A Lexington man will face a judge in less than an hour, accused in a violent home invasion and shooting. Michael Walls is charged with burglary. Police say Walls and another man broke into a house last week on Mount Foraker Drive and shot the man inside. The gunman remains on the loose. WKYT's Mark Barber has the latest on the search in this Crime Tracker report. Mark. Police say the burglars targeted their first home here on Mount Forker Drive last Tuesday. After the first break in, they waited two days, set their sights on the house next door, and then came back again. My wife is pretty concerned. <laughs> Bill Whalen says his family's sense of security has been shattered by the break ins. The two homes next to his were targeted by thieves, and now one of his neighbors is in the hospital. Tragedy, scary, and unnerving. His neighbor was shot when he confronted one of the burglars on Thursday. Waylon doesn't want to discuss the details of his friend's injuries, but we have learned the homeowner was seriously hurt and has been in and out of surgeries. Police say they caught a break in the case when they found a fingerprint on a window in the first home hit by the burglars. That led to the arrest of this 25 year old yesterday. Michael Walls is now charged with first and second degree burglary. He claims the person who was with him pulled the gun on the homeowner. They have children, and, and, and he's a great father. Uh, they got to have a great mother. And for, for that to happen to him, and they're good people, really good people. Police are not releasing much information. They're playing this case pretty close to the vest. They say they are still looking for the shooter and hope to release more information soon. In Lexington, Mark Barber, WKYT. Mark, thank you. And police tell us the burglars returned to the street and tried to hit the second home after they stole a laptop, a PlayStation gaming system, and shoes from the first house.